Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be sharing with you my summer essentials. And I tried to make the shortest list possible. It was really hard. It was really, really hard. So I was like, I will spare you guys so that this video is not like 45 minutes long and just limit it down to 10 things that I really, really feel like I need. First up is this right here. This is called brush on block. It's basically a sunblock within a brush. It is like the most coolest invention. I really am not a fan of sunscreens that are like lotion form that are really sticky and greasy. Like if I'm gonna put a lotion on my body, I want it to be a nice lotion that actually blends in. I feel like with sunscreen it just like sticks on you and you can like feel it all day. For me, powder form sunscreen is definitely the way to go. So all you have to do to use it is you just put this on, which is replaceable, twist it off like so. So all the product is in there and then to get it dispensed into the brush, you just twist it on, wait till you hear that clicking noise, then you take off the top, push this down to reveal the brush. It just automatically dispenses the powder out, but what's nice is that it actually has some coverage to it. Like, you can put this on under your makeup, over your makeup. I prefer to do it over my makeup. I'll just like quickly brush it on. Here, I'll show you guys what I like to do. I'll just quickly brush it on like this. It makes my makeup look better. I'm protecting my skin from the sun because it has SPF 30 in it. It's great for sensitive skin. And if you have dry skin, like I do, don't worry guys, this is not going to dry you out. I was worried at first when I, when I tried this that it was going to dry my skin out even more and that was gonna create like patches on my skin, dry patches, or disrupt my makeup. You know, I already took so much time to apply, I don't want my makeup to look worse. And I was also worried that, you know, it would cause breakouts or anything like that, and it does not. It absolutely does not, so I am completely obsessed with this, and I have been using it nonstop. And I just think it's a great way to just quickly, you know, apply to your face to protect it from the sun. Next up is a game called Toy Blast. You can actually get it on the Google Play Store, which is where I get mine since I have um, Android and I really like it because it passes the time by you know sometimes I feel like I'm so bored and I have nothing to do if I'm just like sitting around waiting for something to happen and then I'm like oh I'll just pull out my phone and I'll just play this little app right here it's, it's definitely really really addicting so it's basically about a girl named Amy it's a little girl and all the players are trying to save her toys <laughs> So you tap on two or more match cubes to collect them. And then you collect the remaining cubes until the goal is complete. Like this. Look, there's orange here. I'm gonna click that. Yellow, red, blue. Oh yeah, I got the TNT. Look at that, three out of three stars because I'm a boss. One million people have actually already downloaded this. It got a 4.4 out of five on the Google Play Store. I don't know, I just think it's really fun. I like puzzle games. I will put it the link in the description box for you guys to check it out. It's completely free to install on your phone. Okay, so next up is, it's another thing that's on my phone, a playlist. I think it is so important to have music, like really good music that you really like, that you really feel in, like especially when I'm working out. I honestly don't know who works out without music. I don't, I don't think it's, it's just not even possible for me. I have to have really good music that I'm like totally feeling. I actually created a playlist. It's called the Emma K playlist. I mainly created it for um, everyone who watches my vlog channel, Matt and Kaylee, but I'm going to tell you guys about it too in case you want to follow the playlist I'm always adding new songs on there I got 58 songs on this baby right here I got some Nick Jonas some Tovlo Becky G Maroon 5 Coldplay Ella Henderson Ariana Grande Jasmine V Avicii Rita Ora BB Rexa Fall Out Boy um, Time Flies Fifth Harmony, Calvin Harris, Sia, Ellie Golding, Jason Derulo, Ed Sheeran, yeah. I have a lot of different artists on here. It's just like whatever songs randomly that I hear on the radio and I'm like, what is that? And then I'll just like find it and add it to my playlist. Next up is tanning lotions. So this first one is Million Dollar Tan. <laughs> it's a mermaid mousse. 
and basically I like using this one because it's instant like yeah it does develop after a few hours darker but when you first apply this it is so incredibly dark like it completely transforms your skin it doesn't smell too bad either I know a lot of tanning lotions you know have like extremely bad smells but this one is not so bad it is strong but it's not like a bad smell or anything so I do use that and I'll usually just get like a mitt to you know massage it in all over my body then this one Matt and I actually get this from Amazon so this is the fake bake flawless self tan liquid it says it is streak free and has an easy application right there definitely true I love using this because when you spray it onto the mitt and then you rub it onto your body it dries instantly you don't feel sticky um, it's very even all over definitely easy to apply I'll just do like three to four squirts and then rub it like just here three to four squirts rub it right here three to four squirts rub it right here so like I just keep like inching up my body with more squirts um, and then I'll actually go over everything two to three times sometimes because this stuff is not instant. You will see the tan within a few hours and it's a really good tan. It's not orangey and neither is this one. This one's not orangey either. But it's just like, dang, it like takes so long to actually see the tan develop. That's the only issue I have with this. But yeah, tanning lotions definitely must have. My fifth summer essential is lipstick and not just any lipstick i feel like you have to find that perfect one that you can just wear with any makeup look it'll always look good this is in rose of attraction it is maybelline color whisper lipstick so i'm actually wearing this right now i figured out where if i'm going to talk about it you know it's not like super intense and bold and bright it's just real chill my sixth one is a moisturizer. So this is actually from Lush and it is called Skin Drink. It's a facial moisturizer. This one is especially for dry skin. It has rich sesame oil cream and is designed to leave a supple protective layer on the face without feeling greasy. Number seven is a dry shampoo. Super, super important guys. Orabe Thick Dry Finishing Spray. And the stuff is awesome. Yes, it is pricey, but it is 100% worth it. I will actually spray this all over. Like, you can spray it in your roots. You can spray it just in your hair in general. And it'll just create more texture to the hair, more volume, and get rid of the greasiness. Number eight is a hat. This is a really cute one that I got from, um, I think this was Cotton On. I just love wearing hats when I go to the beach, which I plan on doing in July. I'm definitely gonna be taking this hat with me and it's just nice for like, if you just got your hair completely wet and my hair is naturally curly, so when it gets wet, it's like big, like big and curly. So I <laughs> will usually put it up in a bun and then I'll just like put a hat on top. It's really cute. I like really, really, really big hats like this. And then can you imagine just sunglasses with my bikini and I'm good to go. I like it. This is my favorite hat. I've actually had these sunglasses for a, no, almost three years. They're from Guess. And every time I get sunglasses, I always try and find ones that kind of have that cat eye shape where they extend like more outwards towards the outer corners just really like that look they they actually block a lot of sun out so um i'll just you know keep these with me at all times and just throw them on whenever i feel like i'm squinting i don't know i read somewhere where, where if the <laughs> i read somewhere that squinting like this like when you're trying to get the sun out of your eye um that it actually causes more wrinkles so every time i'm like about to squint i'm like i put my sunglasses on yeah <laughs> And then lastly is a bikini top that is super colorful. This I got, it says Hula Honey. I think it's from um, Macy's actually. If you get a colorful one like this that has multiple colors in it, then that means that you can wear different color bottoms. So you can wear it more than once. So you could do blue, you could do yellow, orange, purple. There's a lot of different colors in here. And I like that it's like bright and bold and you can keep the bottoms really simple and just do like one color. So I actually bought these two to go with it, these two bottoms. This one's purple, this one's blue. But I think if you just, you know, have one like staple piece top, then you're pretty much good to go for the whole summer. I mean, you really don't need any more, any more than that. All right, guys, so that is it for my summer essentials. Let me know what your summer essentials are down in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.